We have a Kabbalah that the two months of Tammuz and Av correspond to the right eye and the left eye. All the crying of Tisha B'Av is Eini, Eini, Yardamayim. My eyes are crying. And this time of the year of Tammuz and Av, it's a very, very strong time to fix, to repair our eyes. One of the Avaidas of Tikkun Ha'inayim is when we say Kriyashma, when we cover our eyes, we try to connect the Shema Yisrael Shema Kanev Shema Chad. And the Svarim say that the word Shema, Shin Mem Ayin, as the Rosh Hateves, Su Meroim Eneichem. Lift up your eyes. Lift up your eyes to look at things in a different way. Lift up your eyes. Because the truth of the matter is, it's not just that we have a right eye and a left eye. It says, Ki ayin b'ayin, yir b'shuv Hashem tziyan. Ayin b'ayin means that each one of us was given a set of eyes, but we have something that's called ayin b'ayin, the eye that's within the eye. We look at things on the outside, and we have the ability to look at things from the inside. When we close our eyes by Shema, we cover our eyes by saying, Shalom, help me to lift my eyes up to see things in a deeper way, to see in a way of ayin ba'ayin, not to look at things with the physical eyes, but se'u merom eneichem, that I should be able to have ene Hashem el tzaddikim, v'sechazene eneine b'shuv chalitzin rachmim, v'eneine sereine malchusach, that I should have the eyes to see, to see what's important in life, that my eyes, I should have the eyes to see See you, Rabbi Shlom. There's a Maisa by Pinchas Karatz, There was a certain band, a klezmer, that played in Karatz by the weddings. And one of the musicians had showed up recently in town was an old man who they called the Blinde Klezmer, the blind musician. And he played beautiful violin. He played at the Hasnas. When he was dying, Rabbi Pinchas Karatz went to visit him. And Rapinchas Karatz revealed afterwards that this Blinda Klezmer was not really blind. He saw very well, but he was a musician. And he said that at the Chasnas, the women were here, the men were there, and he didn't want his eyes to wander in the wrong direction. So he took upon himself that he would keep his eyes always closed. And he lived that way for years, I don't know. He lived that way with his eyes closed always. Akedekach, the Rapinchas Karatz has said that before he died, he said, I want to see the world one more time. And he opened his eyes and he looked at me and then he was nifta. The music of this musician, of this violinist, of this virtuoso violinist, where did it come from? We can't be in such a madriga. We're not the, the blinder klezmer to close our eyes and to pretend that we're not able to see. We can't live that way. But what the story tells us is that when you work at least to some degree, sometimes we try to cover our eyes. We can begin to hear music that we never heard before. We can begin to play music that we never played before. We can begin to see things in a way that we never saw them before. Hashem Yisbar should help us that we should come to that day of no more any, any other mind, but Ve'inenu se'onam achusach with Mashiach Zikain.